Hey everyone, Justin Jackrell from City Car Electric Vehicles here. Today I want to give you a product demonstration on our six passenger plus one wheelchair street legal golf cart. What we've done here is we've taken our eight passenger golf cart and we've modified the center of the vehicle so we can actually fit a wheelchair with the wheelchair ramp. So what I want to do is take you on the different features and the specifications that this vehicle has. I'll show you everything involving the wheelchair and the wheelchair ramp assembly. And then if you have any other questions, please feel free to contact us at citycarev.com. All right, so first I want to start on the front of the vehicle. On our street legal golf carts, all of them come with this AS1 safety glass. This is very important if you want to have your vehicle street legal. Not only do you have the safety glass windshield, but we've also got a powered windshield wiper instead of a manual one. The vehicle here has a set of headlights and turn signals just like you would have on your car. And I want you to notice that the 10 inch wheels also have aluminum rims. These come standard on all of our street legal golf carts. You've got your three piece mirror set just like you would have on your car. And I also want to show you this parking brake handle right there. It's very important on your street legal golf cart that you've got a separate parking brake handle. Some manufacturers are actually building the parking brake into the actual brake pedal. What happens is if your brakes fail, your parking brake is going to fail as well, which is your emergency brake. So having that separate handbrake is another added feature on all city car street legal golf carts. So now I want to take you to the middle of the vehicle on the dashboard. I'll show you everything that comes standard and then what we include with the wheelchair package. Okay, so I'm down where the driver is going to be sitting. These two buttons right here are going to control not only your wheelchair ramp, but also the light that is going to shine on the wheelchair ramp. So at night, you can turn this light on, and that's actually going to glow pretty brightly on that wheelchair access area to make sure that no one has any issues tripping or falling or have any safety hazards. This button over here is going to be for your wheelchair ramp operation. The vehicle does have to be on to use the ramp, and all you have to do is hold the button in, and it's going to come up. And once again, if you hold it down, it's going to lower the ramp as well. This is going to be powered by a hydraulic pump that's custom fitted right into this vehicle for you. Okay, so here I want to show you how to use the tie downs. We're using top of the line Q strain tie downs. For these tie downs, you're going to have one end of this hooked up to the frame of the wheelchair. Then you put this down below, lift up the black knob, and lock it in a place. Then you can tighten it with the strap and this wheelchair is locked in. You want to do that for all four wheels and make sure that your wheelchair passenger has the brakes applied to the wheelchair as well. To loosen it or to release it, all you have to do is lift up on this black tab, slide it back, and remove it out. All right, so now all the batteries for this model are going to be under the second row of seats. All you have to do is lift this seat up and you're going to see all of your Trojan batteries underneath that seat. On each one of the batteries, you've got a white top. Once a month, you want to take that cap off and fill the battery up with distilled water. You want to make sure you do this monthly to maintain your batteries properly. If you do want to have a single access point, we do have battery watering systems that are available for an additional charge, which will connect all the batteries in a series, so you just have to fill up the batteries in one central location. It only takes a couple of minutes, but make sure you do that once a month, top them off, make sure your batteries stay nice and healthy and charged ready for your vehicle use. So now I want to show you the back of the vehicle. We've got the rear flip seat on this vehicle, and I'll show you the built-in cooler as well to keep your drinks hot or cold. All right, so on this model, we've added a rear flip seat. This obviously comes standard for two passengers, has seat belts just like the rest of the vehicle. If you don't have passengers, you need to carry cargo, though, you could fold this over and lock it in place, and now you've got a nice diamond plate flat utility bed for luggage, transport of anything, any boxes or packages that you have. Then just fold that back up again, and it's ready for your passengers. Down here, we've got a built-in cooler. This unlocks and swings out. Now this cooler is powered and has a vehicle tied in with the power. You can open this up. It's got room for a couple cans of drinks or sodas. Keeps it both either hot or cold. And then this could actually be removed and taken with you if you have a picnic or an outing that you want to keep those drinks cold in. Then you just bring this in and it locks down here. So that's going to do it for me today. All city car electric vehicles are built in our Gainesville, Florida facility and come fully loaded with features such as onboard chargers, made in the USA batteries, controllers and chargers. We've got wood grain dashboards, aluminum rims, street legal packages, AS1 safety glass and more. We have models that range from 2 to 29 passengers and can customize any vehicle to meet your needs. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact us at citycarev.com and we'll be more than happy to help. Once again, my name is Justin Jackrell, and I look forward to speaking with you soon. Thanks for watching.